like, is there a way that we can set up like a monthly like Discord remind? <laughs> I can't believe you haven't I lost yet. My mind, Mr. Morgan. Lost it entirely. Nice to see you too, Reverend. I've lost it. I used to be an intellectual. Now I'm just a fool. Well, You're not a fool, Reverend. I've always been happy as a fool. <laughs> you all just laugh at me. I know you do. Okay, let's You'll just... You'll not charm me, Mr. Bell. <laughs> I'll certainly try. Hmm? <laughs> Does anyone have a feeling that the Reverend is maybe going to snap at some point and, and hurt people? <laughs> Did you say we weren't listening? Exactly. My point exactly. <laughs> every month? Every two months? How, how often are you supposed to be cleaning that thing out? He get- yeah, that's- that's kind of the vibes I'm getting. Like, I know that he's- I think I've heard enough of your opinions, miss. Is that so? Yeah. Now make yourself useful, and the first part of useful is not driving me insane with your constant complaining. I ain't complaining. You are! Complain, complain, complain! I ain't complaining, I'm just saying. You're not saying, miss. You're shouting! Oh, say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. Okay. What is wrong with you two? Let's I just everybody chill out. Vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, The pirate, Morgan, thank you so much for the follow. This. And part right, Ian, thank work? you for the four months. Howdy, partners. Howdy, partners. We're stopping people from killing each other. My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. Okay. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner. Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife. <laughs> Enough, both of you. Well, come with me then. You want to head out there? We got to touch Abigail, um, by the way. Man, so be it. But we or that's Sadie. Hunt. You're my bad. My bad. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, so they got Sorry. We got to touch Sadie. I Wait, I forgot Sadie was guy. here. Wait, who's Abigail? Good. Oh, no. Abigail's the cheater. You need anything, Mr. Hold Pearson? On. Maybe me and Mrs. Adder. Abigail's take a ride. the Domino's cheater. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Here's my list. Right, right. Yeah, yeah. Can you She's post the Domino's this cheater. Me? While you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Okay, can everybody just... Maybe we just all be a little nicer to each other, given the circumstances. Clearly we ain't in that much of a rush. Sadie, this is my wholehearted apology. It has been a very long time since I have had an actual interaction with a woman and I just unfortunately got you confused with Abigail, who's a no good cheating Domino's liar face. Um, for that, I'm sorry. Yeah, doesn't matter, we're on a date now, so. <laughs> Abigail is naggy and Sadie is bossy. I guess. I ain't no scullion. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating half-wit. I guess we all gotta do our share, princess. True, we all Where's got our share. Oh, are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. <clears throat> Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time. So I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. 
Listen to this. I'm listening. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> <laughs> he ever actually even talked to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All males Skirt. except the same alien. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Mr. Blah, thank you so much for the follow. And <laughs> red redheaded man, thank you so much for the follow. Also, part Ian, thank you very much for the reset. I know I said thank you, but I was also screaming and that's not really nice, so. This is a violation of privacy. Yeah, she uh, she appears to not really care. Okay, I kind of missed everything he was talking about before we left. So, shopping list. I can't. Okay. <laughs> he was just talking to Sadie. All right. Never gonna get there in this place. Sorry, I wasn't sure how fast I could go through town. You know. Wait, is this slowing down for okay. me? I think. Here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you- No! You insane? I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws. Not okay, idiots. she's crazy. We I think we're kind of back on Team people. Tilly. We're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. And no guns. There's no so guns. There'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. All right, I'm gonna go to the post office and just hope that she's fine. Nothing. What do you mean nothing? Do do. And let's not run. Let's say. Hey. Ain't nothing to worry about. Weird. Is that how people present themselves? Oh, where is he? Talk to the clerk and send Pearson's letter. Can I help you? I Mr. would like to yes, send I would mail. Like to post a letter. This right. one here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. No trouble. Thank you. Bye now. Bye now. How do you do, sir? Oh, hello there. Hey, y'all. Well, hello there. How do you do? Good. How do you do? All doing all right? Just be good, I guess. I mean, the woman just lost her husband. <laughs> She's allowed to be a bit crazy. She's allowed to be crazy, but she just can't shoot random shopkeepers. <laughs> that that is the red dead version of being left on red do you cosplay because think of miss cookie make it be i did have um um uh, i really wanted to do an elizabeth cosplay from bioshock um lady i got it all in the wagon there i could train my goat to do this faster Sadie? I think this is everything. Thanks. Here, Thank you. Take that for yourself, okay? Yep. 
Thanks. That. Well, give yeah. it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Okay, okay. get on. I'm about done here. All right. I'm gonna get on, but you don't need I'm to watching. I'm doing it right. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. Oh I'm gosh. Sadie, not lady. I know. Get up. So you get everything. I now we so. can. And some new outfit. New clothes, I see. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you. My husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little. It's a good look for her. her hair, it's a good look. Sadie and Mary day. Beth are probably my two yeah, favorite female characters, that. and next to Arthur, you Sadie is my favorite now. overall. <laughs> we love her pants. Yes. Playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. True. That did happen. I'm real sorry about what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want a no harmonica kid. or a Just husband. Treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing from me ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook, please. Hey there. Hey. Hi. What, uh, what you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lamorne Raider country. Keep it cool. Steve. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Go, go, go! go. Let's get the hell out of here! Wait, I need to fend them off? What the hell was that? They was gonna rob us. New pair of pants. Think you're landing rickets. Oh, shut up. I'm Look gonna at that. run this son of a bitch down. Oh, my gosh. Well, you wanted to see some action, lady. Now you got your wish. Deal with the remaining outlaws. Okay. How are you still alive, sir? Alright, well, quick! All right, I was gonna loop, but no, guess we have no time anything. for that. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble uh, already. Uh, ladder, Rias, thank you so much for the follow. We showed those. Wait, am I driving now? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. Did good, but that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe, if he asks. But maybe not. Oh my gosh, I'm going the wrong way. I am. Who do they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. All right. How about this and here? Don't you go ribbon pierced about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. Oh, uh, like <laughs> won't let you go fast. That journal of yours. The mind Quick of draw, fall. McGraw. Uh, Actually, true. aim was not too terrible there. Not too terrible. Um, I don't know. She got back on, so I wasn't sure if I like had enough time or if she was gonna leave me or what was gonna happen. So I panicked. Hello, hello, Arthur Morgan. How's it going? You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. Ah, uh, 
I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they okay, say I Okay, that's a like solid mass, maybe. I we'll take it. Smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And... Okay. Pants, by the way. Oh, shut up. We finally got a silver! Okay. I'm normally like a bronze quest type of person. Oh, no hey. harm done. Next time we run an errand together, remind me to pack more bullets. Come on, Arthur. Don't pretend that wasn't kind of fun. <laughs> I guess. Okay, well, let's talk more later. Okay, Arthur. Okay, we're getting some chuckles. I think our, our friendship is blooming. Nacho Connery, thank you so much for the follow. Hi, can't do. Hi, Walid. Hi, Tilly. <gasps> okay, hold on. How are you? Alive. And you? Fine. Let me ask you a question. Sure. If I was to kill Miss Grimshaw, would Dutch oh, no. be mad? I think, as a general rule, Dutch likes to avoid murder within the camp. I mean. It was that one time, but he was a traitor. But Miss Grimshaw, well, Dutch has a soft spot for her. I thought as much. Was she always like this? I ain't quite old enough to know. <laughs> no, of course. So as long as you've known her? She's always liked her swill of vinegar. I'd like to give her a swig of arsenic. We'll just okay. do it discreetly. I will. You fancy a game of dominoes? Sure, why not? I thought you would never if I'm ask. With you, she'll leave me alone. <laughs> I don't see any cookie eating. Can't Jimmy, I got something very special for you today. Oh yeah, I thought something looked different. You're asking, well, are those Dunkaroos? I'm sure I can yes, easy they are. <laughs> I'll keep my eye out for you too. Okay, that's just the sustenance we needed. Okay. Target score, all fives. What? This is a new Domino's. Oh my god, Dunkaroos. Oh yeah, there's Dunkaroos here. I was asking WTF are those. There, look at that. Look at that. And if you're asking, is that fun, Fetty? Um, frosting? It is. Yep. Oh, yeah. I'm not playing around. Okay, it appears we have a new game of dominoes. We're, we're not gonna play the whole thing, just like two rounds, get a feel for it. Uh, show Tilly that we're awesome at dominoes. She falls in love with us. Easy peasy. Should I be calling you Deputy Morgan now? Arthur? Win. Whatever you say. Okay. So, if we do this two on her two, there's a five. I think she scored five points because, I mean, her domino is five. All right, I'm going to play this one and see where it gets us. Oh, I see, I see. So whenever Tilly plays a domino, she gets five points. Whenever I play a domino, I get zero points. That makes sense. Very clear. Um, so will this give me, no, no, no. Five there. points, please. And points for me. Nothing here. Oh. Oh, wait. Hmm. 
Do I understand this? Okay, I'm not gonna score any points, but that's okay. Oh man, yes. Okay, because the four and the six. So. I mean, four and one. If I play a four and one, that makes an eight. I need that six to be something else. I'm just gonna use this for now. I guess I kind of feel bad for you. There, can play that. Why am I picking up? Why am I picking up tiles? Do I have to play this one? Sixes. The spinner no tile. Real shit. Give me something. I'm very confused. Oh, all right. Well, I thought this was just regular old dominoes, but this is not. I had no patience for these weird variations of dominoes. I felt very confident in like regular dominoes play, but I don't like, I'm not liking this one very much right now. So if I play this, edge score will be four. Edge score will be six. But this at least gets a domino out there, of my hand. But all for nothing. Wait, what is that? What is this little maneuver? Okay. It makes an eight. Okay. Drat. Ah, oh, here's one. We did almost touch her hand, so. <laughs> yeehaw, yeehaw, one love. How's it going? This is the variation that my mom plays and always lose against her. Like. Something isn't adding up. Oh, you can like go off of. Twelve. Wait, wait, it's a three. Yes, I'll get 15 points. Okay. Okay, let's see, 20. So how do I make... How do I go back to the table view? What's this saying? That's like the only place I can put it. Whatever, let's play it. I got Domino here. I'll take it. You'll get precious Yikes. little from me. <laughs> Hand touching. I didn't know Ray was so bold. I'm I, I'm feeling I was feeling pretty uh confident Killing in the dominoes play. Dominoes like let's play players. some dominoes. Keep them on their toes. Not the way you oh, want to get but arrested though. Maybe we should let Tilly win. Headline. Well, keep your eye out then. Right? Nothing on this one. Okay. All right, so that's a s 12. Is there any way? That makes a 13. 
This makes a 14. No, no, no. Oh, this makes and Dutch 16. That twinkle in their eyes again. That usually means trouble. I was thinking the same thing. Kind of have to play this because <clears throat> don't have anything to play off a of one. Seventeen. Seventeen. I can make an eighteen. Six. Oh, because I blocked. Okay. Hmm. Uh, got nothing to also make a five. So let's play this. Make her play something. At least no riding dwarves show up when they change the rules of Domino. Wait, what did, what did she play? Oh, she played this. Okay. Yes! Yes! That's five for us. And I have a three. No, 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 no. That's not how that works. Five. Oh, but if I do this, then I score five. Okay. I'm not enjoying this very much, but... Boom. Ten points me. Oh, we're catching right up. here. Okay, got a six. Six. That's that's just like my only move. Okay. Domino. Oh darn it. Do okay How? Here. I saw that, but I don't. Wait, Anne, get your gun. I don't know who Anne Oakley is either. Anne Oakley. It sounds familiar, like I should know. Okay. Where did she get 95 points? I looked at chat for one second. Why would you let her win? I don't know. Is that like a nice like Oh, you'll have your chance on the next one. Okay. <sighs> that didn't go well. Oh, okay. Sharpshooter. Gotcha, gotcha. No. I would not let Ann Oakley <laughs> win a sharpshooting contest against me. When camp requests are fulfilled, they appear as a exclamation point with the character in question. Check in with them to complete the request. Okay, so who has one of those right now? Whoever this person is. Oh, it's Tilly. Um, I don't know what I was gonna say. Like, isn't that, you know... There he First. is. The man who saved my hide not once, but twice. What you want, Micah? Nothing. Just saying thank you, brother. I can't call you brother, can't I? I think I like you even less when you're friendly. You're the first person ever told me that. Mm. What do you want, Micah? Anyways, back to what I was saying. I feel like, isn't that sort of first date vibes? Like, you let the other person win, or you don't go as competitive to, you know, like, scare them off immediately. Why are you dressed so ridiculously, sir? So it help me, I'm stoned and eating everything on site. I recommend Dunkaroos, one love. You okay, Arthur? 
You want to talk? Sure. Yes. What's been going on with you? I don't know. I... What? Been acting kind of crazy. Mm-hmm. How so? I've been killing a lot. I mean, innocent folk. I don't know why. Yeah, no, we haven't. Either. I don't know why we're that's saying that. We bad. really haven't. I know. I just... Well, you know me. Sure. I know you. But then you go act all crazy. Rupa, but I've always been crazy. No, you haven't. Maybe Mike could put a spell on me. And maybe that's you're just it. being a fool. You know, there's always Probably that. not. Give request. I found this. You said you lost yours. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you. Here, please take this. It's the least I can do. You boys act right and learn to do things proper. What did I just give her? This could be yours. Uh, apparently I had something that she wanted, so... I think you killed innocents when you broke Mike out of jail. Oh yeah, you mean, uh, lawmen? Well, it was self-defense at that point, because they were shooting at us first. You know, all I was trying to do was escape from jail. <laughs> Apparently I had something she wanted, indeed. <laughs> Because you blew up the jail. No, no, I just tore down a wall of the jail. Lawmen aren't innocent. Exactly. Nobody, nobody is innocent in any of this. I think mistakes were made on all sides. Um, oh, should I help around the camp? Okay, bring it to Pearson's. Thank God somebody's doing some work around here. That's what I'm saying. And it keeps, uh, keeps end up being me, I'm noticing. Okay, that's one. And two. How do, how do I make the Hello, outer people. Get a wall top. You're going to get Ooh, your child dressed like that. Thank you. Um, how do I make the outer ring on my health core go up? Because it seems like stamina has been pretty good, probably from just like running on foot, but... I think Ray is actually an <laughs> a defense attorney, right? These arguments are top shelf. Those lawmen weren't innocent. My client was acting in self-defense as lawmen were shooting at him. Over here. I was just about to move those. Yeah, well, I got to it first, so maybe you get me on the next one. Okay. Um... I'm afraid to talk to Dixon. Wonder. I mean, talking to Dixon will probably set up a couple. What's the M? I can't get Oh, it's Micah. Oh, I strongly dislike 
Sit down, my dearest friend. Maybe. <laughs> Dixon, exactly. The internet says to increase your health, engage in fist fight, shoot your bone and arrow. Stab you in the face. Oh. So constantly remaining at low health isn't good enough. You know, I think the last time I played this was with Skinny and those boys and Strawberry. Okay. Ooh, my heart's racing. move okay w and s w and s w and s your go relax w s watch and learn oops w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s w s okay went a little slow i also messed up the first one so easy W A, which is what I had done initially. Ow. Yeah, okay. Kuda Gamer, thank you so much for the follow. W A. Oh Ooh, shoot. W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W A W Longer you go, worse you'll miss. Okay. Micah must win to stay in the game. W D. Oh! Don't mess up. Don't mess up. Oh. Okay. Bad manners. Bad manners. W D W D W D W D W D W D W D four D four D W D W D W D four D W D W D W D four D uh uh Look mom No hands Well I've seen some fancy in before you're good I know Play again sometime Micah stabs himself for our amusement. Okay, that didn't really seem super fair and square because I know I messed him up on uh, his See you his round to stay in, but anytime there, Micah. Okay. Enough of your monkey shines, Arthur. Daddy hey, Alfred. Uncle. You okay, Uncle? Yeah, I'm gonna do some sniffing around, see if I can drum up some leads. Well, okay. do it quietly. Well, I should get back to it. Yep, yep. Okay, Arthur. Okay. Oh, hold on. I want some stew. Oh my God. Put on some warmer clothes, friend. That woman. That... Words fail me. Who's he talking about? Take. Hey, Alexander, how's it going? We're gonna eat just fine. I got us a score, got something good. I said, I got us a score, Miss Roberts. Maybe you'll let me take you out sometime. I don't think so. I shall. Hey, Batman, go buy us something decent to eat, hmm? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Wait, Micah is hitting on Abigail? Hey there. Hi there. 
Wait a minute. Doesn't Micah have blonde hair? And doesn't little Jack have blonde hair? All you folk can thank Uncle Micah when the eating's good. You hear? Okay, I'll ponder that. <laughs> Wait, Jack has brown hair? Turned out by a prostitute? That's the lowest. <laughs> Feels bad. Uh... Oh, Cicada just started chapter six. Oh my gosh, I feel like chapter six is so far away. Feels like forever. Lumbago is a serious condition. I will never uh, downplay Lumbago for the rest of my life now that I know how debilitating a disease it is. So, what do you think of this place? Seems fine for now. I know this area a little. Is there anywhere you ain't been, Jose? True. Okay, I'll catch you later then. All right, Arthur. Hi, Jose. Mike is newer to the game than the kid. Oh, uh, okay. I'm gonna try this lumbago crap at work. <laughs> Be like, uh, I can't, I can't today, boss. The lumbago's really acting up. But maybe, maybe that Micah interesting choice of outfit. knew that Jack was his and he then was like, all right, oh, I don't want to be like an absent father or whatever. Hey, Bill. Yeah, right, Bill. Can't believe we're running away from Cornwall. What's happened to us? It was time to move. Um, so then he asked to be in our little gang here. So, you know, he could be around more. I think you're grasping at straws. All right, fair enough, fair enough. Also, the fact that the kid has brown hair, not blonde hair. Just so you know, I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill all of them. Who, Mrs. Adler? Those old Driscoll's. I'm gonna find them and kill each and every one of them bastards. Just watch me. You've had a bad time, but, but we ain't in the revenge business. It don't keep you fed. <sighs> Just watch me. Oh, okay. Let's, uh... Let's right, not. Well, I should be getting on. Okay, Arthur. Okay, how about you go back to camp? I don't know where you're headed exactly, but it's making me nervous. Okay, she's coming back. What else can I do? All right, I feel like I should talk. Otherwise, uh, Dutch, like, won't come back to camp. He's just gonna sit out there this whole time. <laughs> just saying, I have brown hair, dad has blonde hair, it can happen. Probably, because isn't blonde hair a recessive trait? So, him having blonde hair and Abigail having dark hair... Well, no. Then there is a... Then there's a 20... No. Hold on. Everyone draw your little pun and square, right? Big A, little A. And he is little A, little A. Mr. Morgan. Yep. Can I ask you a favor? If, if it's convenient, I mean. I mean, sure. I was just trying to draw a pun and square, but go ahead. If you're ahead. your adventures and you see any herbs for seasoning would you mind grabbing them for me season yes don't tell mr pearson <laughs> okay i'll see what i can do okay we're all having a chuckle over that <laughs> lordy you're pondering this too much all right all right I'll give up on my dream of hey, Micah sure, and Abigail together. Sport. Hey there, John. You must be nervous being this close to the water. Oh, don't you start. <laughs> I'm just looking out for you. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Okay. All right. 
go talk to Dutch, so then he can uh, head back towards camp. Doing, Pretty good. Uh, it's funny, us ending up down here. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania, fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. I see I'm born. <laughs> Diesel kid. Have you Morning. met Ray? Uh, I am a there. ponderer we of sorts. Have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, Ghost, thank you so much for the follow. There's gonna be casualties. We're thieves. In a world that don't want us no more. We are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts. Now I'll give you that, but come on. We got the day. It's nice out. Okay. Old Jose says that there's a trick around here. I reckon it's full of fish. No, not fish. Oh no. Unfortunate. I haven't heard of the jean square since high school. I'm bringing it back. I'm bringing it back. Am I saying that right? Pundit square? Right? Hey, Maybe I just made that up. Girl, come on down here. Why don't you show us this crick you've been pissing in? Hey, you don't look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would... My days are looking good and long over. Gosh. <laughs> Always green crushing and bubble burst at you. Come on. All right, hot tomato. I got to go fishing, I guess. All right, gentlemen. Let me show you how it's done. Okay. Behind you. Okay, go. Oh, I didn't mean to Okay. Why don't we just fish here? There's a whole lake of them. Because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there, oh, there was a us. The curious couple and their unruly son. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. Thank More you. Charles than me. It's like I can breathe again, thick and soupy as this air is. Might even do your whistling pipe some good, Jose. I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. But what a life we have lived, how well we have fought, especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. Make mm -hmm. enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. But we don't have to hide. Uh, like where? I got some ideas hatching, but I need you with me, not against me. Why is he Both so you, paranoid Still, that somebody's gonna like rat him money. out or like so turn him in or whatever? Wild, especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. But start turning over the soil. And the rock. That is us again. Not to use weapons up. or cause trouble Dutch. on roads. We have got to be discreet. Imagine Easy. what a slew of rich, simple tins there must be down here. Oh, ho, ho. this is perfect for you, Hosea. You'll be able to play them like a fiddle. Nothing would give me greater pleasure, but no buts. Not today. We fish and we enjoy the day. Looks like law up ahead. Play it cool. Right. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Everybody, play it cool. Do not ruin this for Hello, us. Hello, gentlemen. Well, look what the cat drug in. I seem to have gotten myself in a spot to bother. Quiet back there. Let's see if we can't sort this out. <laughs> How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. 
Hoagie McIntosh? This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. Hey, it's good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. <laughs> now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool. But he is not a bad fellow. Now, can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you! I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! I can't have more scandal! Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Chase wanted man. Uh, and, and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come on, big guy! Are Perhaps we... We can discuss the foolish magician. Stay with that train! Don't let them get away! Keep your guns holstered. We need them Anderson boys alive. Okay. Come on, hurry. All right. Come on, we're losing them. We're we not. Relax, we're not losing them. Exactly. Faster, come on. What's your name, sir? Arthur. Arthur Callahan. Why would we go Mr. with Callahan, Arthur? Please. My neck is on the line here. I get it. I'm doing my best. Looks like a son of a bitch is gonna make it. You sure I can't just shoot him? No! Did I not say that? You said plenty. Go on, deputy! Woo! I don't know, I'm kinda getting- Oh! oh! That must hurt. Leave him, stay with that train. Oh, the okay. slowing down to go through the station. Now's our chance. Get to the Sorry, side of the train. read the situation wrong. Keep us close to the train. I'm going, I'm going. See the flat carriage? Head yep. for that. Get us as close as you can. Okay. You, think you can jump on there? Me? Why me? Because you ride like oh! my Oh! Watch out, he's throwing bombs at him. Cop bastard. I didn't do nothing. No. You bastard. Break free! Break free! That's enough. Damn it. Go on, don't lose him. Just hit him, but don't kill him. Hit him, but don't kill him. Hit him, but don't kill him. Okay, nice. Come on, you stop them, I'll stop the train. You're only making it worse. I'm coming for you next. I'm gonna ride ahead and stop the train. It's just us then, lawman. Come here. We need to bother. Let me go. Can't do that. Let's Try at least. Ooh. Man. Just don't kill him. I'm not gonna 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 kill him. Oh god. Oh god. Come on, hit him, but don't Decent kill him. Team. Come on. I don't think I can open the door from the outside, unfortunately. Waste of my time. Hello? Is everything all right in there? Well, I don't think he's dead. I think I won the fight. Oh, just about. Yeah, he's just sleeping, you guys. Bring him out here. It's all Maybe. good. Sounded like quite a commotion. Uh, do you need to play Red Dead him? 1 for this one? I I've actually sure heard that so. you Old should Anders play this Anderson. one first. So what now? Take him in. Come on. A fine job. Well done. Wait. Pat on the back for me for stopping the train. Load Anders onto the back of your horse there and we'll... Hold on a second. Something tells right. me we should tie what him up. What are you doing? Oh! Oh! Yes, hog tie. Sorry, I was looking for this button. Apologies. I feel like that was my bad. 
I was trying to throw and now, then. Please? Yep. Put him on your horse and let's go. Okay. <laughs> I feel bad, Tyra. There you go. <laughs> Sorry. You are a natural. Oh, I miss leveling up right, health. Up. Robo over. Oh, I could probably do the All Master right, Hunter the one. Follow I feel like I have gone up like up a level, but oh, we'll round them up. you just wanted Anders to kick him. I promise it was a sure misunderstanding. You're the boss. That was mighty impressive, sir. I have to admit. Oh, do you think I could work for the law? At some point. Well, I wouldn't exactly say that. Are you familiar with the area here? No, not really. On your right here, these tobacco fields? Mm -hmm. This is part of Caliga Hall, big estate belonging to the Gray family. Looks bone dry. Yes, we are in dire need of some rain around here, let me tell you. The Grays have lived in Caliga Hall for generations. Fine people. My family's been working for them for years. Sheriff Gray's the one I know best, of course, but they own half the businesses in town. Which town? Rhodes, sir. You don't know it? Where we're headed right now. Ain't what it was before the war, but it has its charms. I'm sure you already know of the Braithwaites. Like I said, we just got down here. Another big family in these parts. They have an estate west of here. Awful people, truly awful. They've been fighting with the Greys for as long as I can remember. Sounds okay. like quite the place you got here. So the Greys and the Braith Braith rates. Braith rates. We're gonna bear left here. Okay. <laughs> I like how it pops up the little reminder of like just a reminder. Dutch has specifically asked not to get in trouble. It is quite, quite dry. I will have to agree. Here we are. <laughs> Welcome to Rhodes. Oh. Up there on your left is the Rhodes Parlor House. Mm-hmm. Very reputable saloon owned by the Gray family. Okay. I we thought we didn't like them. We also have a general them. store, gunsmith, post office, train station, of course. What more do you need? Very little. Oh, good. They're back. And that's your friend, right? Yep. Okay, we're gonna stop just ahead on the right, outside the sheriff's office. Can you grab Anders off your horse and carry him in for me? Sooner you get him off your horse, sooner we can get him in a cell. Yep. No problem here. Carry him over then. Hey, fellas. Hey there. Oh, wait. Just this bring way? him here. I'm coming. Mr. Gray! We got him. Very good. I told you Arthur would deliver. Man has a passion for justice. That's wonderful. So, uh, about my friend here? Your idiot friend is free to go. But no more trouble from you, partner. I promise you, this was all just a big misunderstanding. Right? Uh, this guy knows it happens to the best of, of us. Now, I'll pretend to appreciate that. Mr. McIntosh, it has been a real pleasure. The mostly good citizens of Rhodes, we welcome you. Well, we're just honored to be here. And make your we friend really behave. Are. We got enough trouble from some of the residents, old timers who've gone sadly to seed and lost their dignity. How terrible. Come along now. I will keep this fellow on the straight and narrow. Well, come back and see us sometime soon. Excuse me, gentlemen. Uh, Bo? These better be ugly rumors. Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Braithwaite? I can't thank you enough. Where have you been? Ooh. Around? And where are you staying? I'm renting a caravan on the edge of town behind the church. It's horrible, but no one comes looking. The whole town is trapped in this interminable feud between the two families. His lot, Gray's, and Braithwaite's. Interesting. Braithwaite's. Two old plantation houses and falling out rebel gold and marrying cousins or not marrying Arthur that's Jose you start poking around 
See what you can find out about that. I have missed you, boys. I've heard about bounty. Well, there's been a price on my head for 13 years. It'll take a month to find us down here, and it seems like we can have a little sport. Well, they're good bounties. Where you hear this? Some fellas I met at a camp near the state line said there was talk of it in bars in the north and west for 500 miles. There was talk. We're of famous. I effin love this game. It's a good <laughs> game, Blob. It's just talk. I'm sure it is. We're just some but good old law abiding you. citizens. We trouble. are now assisting you, the law. We're so good. Huh. Let me just leave that guy there. Okay. So these two plantation families. Arthur, you start sniffing around the Gray's place, see what the story is there. Yeah, I passed by it earlier with our friend, Archibald. Good. Hosea, you see what you can find out about these Braithwaites. All right. Thank you, Arthur. Quite a fishing trip. There's still time. I'm up for it. How about you, Arthur? Have you had enough of the chase for one day? Let's go fishing. Sure, why not? Great. Hosea, why don't you lead us to that spot you were talking about? I kind of like this place. Okay. Let's see if we can avoid any more excitement. Oh, best behavior only. I want a hat like these people. Oh, I need my... Is everybody calling their horses? What's going on? Look at this trio. All right, gentlemen, follow me. I'm a little biased, but hot tomato in comparison to the other two. Easy peasy. So how far is this creek? It's a bit of a ride still, and it's not a creek. It's the same lake we camped on, just a different pipe. Okay. It'll be worth it. I saw some big drum and sturgeon there. Should be rock bass, bluegills, perch, pickerel, too. It's a good spot. We'll see if you're as good at catching fish as you are at catching criminals, Arthur. Oh, I can already uh, tell you. It's not going to be great. But his information is good. Plus, I don't get we are the now fishing in with this the local game. Law. I'd say it was a worthwhile diversion all around. Sheriff Greg? So, you're going back to see that Sheriff Greg? Yeah, I don't see why not. They don't know who we are down here. He didn't seem the sharpest attacks. Neither did that deputy. If he thinks we can be useful to him, he can certainly be useful to us. A little hiding in plain sight. I feel like we're always hiding in plain sight. But sometimes more smartly than others. Uh, Trelawney? Trelawney's like a bad penny. I'm not sure how good a magician he is, but he's certainly good at disappearing when he feels like it. Where does he go? Everywhere and nowhere, it seems. We wouldn't have got Sean back if he hadn't been weaseling around down that way, though. Hey, Dutch, remember that time you found him in the outhouse? <laughs> oh, yeah. We hadn't seen him in weeks. And we then you found him in an outhouse? Dead end town in the middle of nowhere. Don't even remember the name. You and Bill were off doing something, Arthur. <laughs> so, we pick up some supplies. I go to relieve myself. Open the door, and there's Trelawney. Sitting there, newspaper in hand. Mr. Vanderlyn, I say, what the hell are you doing here? And he said, I could ask you the same thing. Now, if you wouldn't mind giving me a little privacy, I ate a rotten oyster. <laughs> Ew. Ew. Hey, maybe there are actually a hundred Chalonis. This is the spot. Down to the left there. Oh, nobody liked our joke. Okay. I saw some boats around last time. Be good to get to deeper water. Okay. Hey, those are the boats you mean? 
Yes. Good. Where? Oh, okay. I'm sure nobody would mind if we borrowed one of these. Come on. Easy peasy. Right, who have you met so far in the game that you want to know more about? All right. Um This looks like a fine vessel. Okay. I don't know how much deeper they Come go on, into Arthur. like Let's everybody's in stories in <laughs> camp, but like I got a good curious to know Tilly's incredible sturgeon. Uncles oh, okay, Hosea's even Dutch, like, I kind of get that everybody's been on the run for, like, over a decade or whatever, but, like... You're too dumb for anything else. <laughs> You're still too quick for me, old man. Enjoy picking on children. Now take us to the deeper water and pray for good luck and stupid okay. fish. Is this me? Well, what about stupid luck and good fish? That'll do, too. Uh -huh. Get us a bit deeper. No! Sticky keys! No! Okay. Maybe if I hold left shift instead of tapping it because... <laughs> Love the Red Dead streams. Mostly been working. Or been lurking. Yeah, no worries, Sir Elrod. Appreciate you being here. Ray, have you ever considered playing Skyrim on the stream? Might be cool to do a stream or two. Oh my gosh. I would like... Oops. Am I going past? Um, I think he is good. All right. Good luck, gentlemen. Quick. Should really come here at dawn or dusk. That's when you catch the best fish. We should use a lake lure. That'll give us a much better chance of hooking something big like a sturgeon. What's wrong I... with a good old worm? Oh, uh, worms are... Okay. We, we want big fish, so... We want cheese... Or what's this? Aha. Uh -huh. Good for okay. tiddlers like bluegill and rock bass, but you'd have to be real lucky to catch a sturgeon with one. Lures it is then. You heard the Oh wait, did I take it off? Expert, Arthur. Let's bait up. Keep the lure moving slowly on the Wait, how do I put the How do I put this one back on? Butter so it looks like a little fish just oh, asking rip. to be eaten. I took it off and I didn't mean to. Okay. Hold this to attract fish when reeling slowly, and then press this when you feel a bite. Got a nibble there, Arthur. Fish oh, I got line, it. Arthur. They're nibbling. Got him. That feels like a bite. Got one. Damn it, I lost him. Oh, too fast? Okay, and reeling more. And when we see him struggle this way and this way. And reel. Hey, we caught an actual fish. There you go. Well done, Arthur. What Didn't is this? Lot bigger than that. Fella told me he once saw a monster lake sturgeon near the mouth of the river, just southwest of Saint Denis. Should I throw it back? He reckoned. <laughs> I would like to see that. There you go. That's a nice one. I'm gonna God. throw it. I should have had that one. Okay. All right keep all the fish why i thought people liked it when you when you uh throw it back in hey Jose, you remember that time we sent arthur out fishing he came back with three beautiful bass not this again i don't think i do oh yeah you do he was maybe 20 21 walked in all full of himself we had a big feast Toasted him all night. 
This was 15 ha! years got ago. Him. Got him, got him, got I him, got him. remember now. <laughs> then, the next week, Arthur and I are at the market, and Fishmonger calls out, So how did you enjoy those bass? <laughs> Look, you can fish, or you can go drinking all day, rob someone, and buy some fish. You hooked him? Ha! Got ya! I used to go fishing with this feller back in the day. Wesley, his name was. Real miserable bastard, but he loved to fish. We go out all the time. But one day, we were river fishing when we see a funeral procession going over the bridge, and out of the blue, Wesley stands up, takes off his hat, bows his head. Then he sits down, picks his rod back up, and carries on. Doesn't say a word. So I'm a little surprised and say, Wesley, that was nice of you. And he replies, well, felt I had to. After all, I was married to her for 30 years. <laughs> oh, there he is. Woo! Oh, dear God. I might swim to shore. Well done. We got steelhead trout, sometimes called rainbow trout. This tasty catches a top of those big prize. Got in Montana last year? Keep. We had a banquet planned that night until copper went and scoffed a lot. You okay. never had control of that dog. Uh, he had some spirit, though. And never lost the throw. puppy in him. Not to the end. You know, Great. I remember us saying Bambino. how Blackwater was the furthest Bambiano. east we ever been. Thank you so much for the follow. I mean. Feels Oop, like the more on, we try nothing. to head west, the further east we end up. We had all those safe spots picked out to lie low in New Austin after the ferry job. I liked it there. Still open and wild the way it should be. Somehow the desert makes you feel closer to the sky. Oh, no let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna get back that way anytime soon. Pinkertons have patrols out all over tall trees and great plains. We saw when we went back for Sean. Well, look at us now, huh? It could be worse. Plans change. That's just how life goes. That's on the hook, Arthur. Did I ever tell you my mother's buried in Blackwater? Stop. Really? She in is? Here? Apparently so. I, uh, I only found out from an uncle of mine years later. Last I knew, she was still outside Philadelphia. I left home at 15 and didn't see her again. She and I didn't always see eye to eye. I wasn't always a very obedient child. I can only imagine. Still, I loved her. In my own way, and she, me, in hers, <laughs> somehow, even from the grave. Let's go. She managed to have the last laugh. Nicely done, Arthur. Wait, what is that? Do you guys see what that was? Knox the King, thank you so much for the follow. Yep, I'll keep this. That's a keeper. Hello? Do you guys see that? It's a snake. Can I catch it? <laughs> it's a river monster. Wait, I love that show. Wait, what's the guy? The guy that is, uh, already, like the Arthur? fisherman on River Monster is the Loch Ness Monster! Can I catch it? Are you just spectating now, Arthur? No, I'm looking at this huge freaking snake in front of us and nobody seems to care! Shoot it! Oh, we're gonna catch him this time. Oh, we gotta do this, though. So. It looks like you got a bite, Arthur. Now reel him in, Arthur. Yep, yep. And real. How many fish do Jeremy Wade? Yes. Something. I was like, I think his name is Jeremy. 
That guy is awesome. I just thought it was like really scary, but. Oh, we're going a lot faster now. Good job, Arthur. What's that, Bass? Smallmouth. Ian Big Pan fried these flaky fish meat fish grow larger in females than males. They prefer stray crickets. Throw Very back. It's good you. for my heart. Okay, when do I get to stop fishing though? Imagine if this game had piramas. Yank at it to pull in faster. Wait, what do you what do you mean yank? It's a danger noodle. I just saw that hat camera. I'm getting started with Valley vibes. Although the the little um in Stardew Valley, like that little bobber thing is actually it's hard. Wonder if I should fish on the other side. What about over here? Nope, I can't. Alright, should I get like one more? Oh, when I pull my pull away? Okay, I'll do one one more. One more. See if we can get a sturgeon. We'll do like a little little cast like that. Set. Go out farther towards the danger snake. Arthur's got a bite. Nice, you hooked him. No, you lost him. <laughs> no! Oh, how? My bad. I'm not sure what I did there, but... Felt... Man, I felt that was going to be a good one, too. It vibrates with controller. I don't know, PC, but in console, you pull the left analog stick towards you quickly. Oh. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if there's something like that. You got a bite. Just yep. gotta reel him in okay. now, Arthur. Yep, I gotta control it first. Keep it going. Uh, the only thing that I see is like if you press R at the same time as the real thing, like pulls it in faster, Not but. Bad, Arthur. A favorite among anglers. They make up in fight for what they lack in taste, though the flaky fish meat can be eaten. They like crayfish. All right, sounds like this is not very tasty. Holds we'll throw it back. One, okay. Hey, I reckon we call it a day. I reckon. Already? You yep. ain't been chasing down outlaws. This has been very fun, though. All right. Think we got a decent haul here. Pearson will be happy. Should we head back? We could keep the boat not too far back to camp from here. Good idea. What about our horses? What about the horses? Well, they'll find their way back. Just right? Arthur and I were both that like, wait a minute. <laughs> Thank you, boys. Thank now, you. Okay. Yes. How about a song? Okay. Uh, all right, I got one for you. Okay. I asked that 
That's I have picked up on the uh, the songs all appear to have double meetings. Oh, wait, wait, wait. hold on, everybody. Okay, I almost passed we out from rowing. Say she, she, I can't even say it. Sea shanty, sea shanty, sea shanty, she shanty. Yeah. <laughs> she shanty, lost on the first one. Okay. Yeah, that's a good one. Bravo. Well, you know, we should not let the folks back in. Is this this is us, right? We're close. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Alright, Jack's just playing by himself out there. And spin this thing in. All right. This is the saddest boat that has I ever think, sung a uh, sea shanty. I, I mean, gave it my we, all. I just didn't know the words. You're gonna be okay. I know. Well, I always know. Whenever I got you two by my side. Things are gonna be just fine. Yes, they will. This place will be good for us. For now, anyway. I hope so. Well, I am going to take in the view. I'll give these fish to Pearson. It is a pretty view. I must agree. I say this every time, but this game is beautiful. I literally say this every time. I just like stop and take in the sights. Like, yep, this is a good looking game You're right here. Those Hi, Charles. Good job finding this spot. You found it too. I wouldn't have. If you hadn't talked me into it. Okay, well, let's talk more later. All right. Kung Manu. Hong Manu. Yeah, thank you so much for the follow. That's Ella. Oh, yeah, yeah. Doo -doo. All right, I feel like we should probably. You know, one time, just off the horn, a giant whale stalked us for months. The same thing happened to me just south of Milwaukee, only I don't like to talk about it. I have nasty memories, though. You're not a kind man. <laughs> I'm not fooled! Alright, I too would like to donate. I would like to donate. Please. Okay. I guess I don't get to. What? Where is the little camp where I can cook, like, meat for myself? I should probably do just, like, a little spin around here. See if I can find it. 
Also, hi, Enders. So, Arthur, is it true about the bad luck? What bad luck? I just broke my pocket mirror, and I remember my old ma saying that a broken mirror means seven years bad luck. Seven years? We won't see seven years out. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. But if I find a mirror on my adventures, I'll bring it back for you. Thank you, Arthur. Oh my gosh, well, it's the f least we could do after telling her that we're all going to be dead in seven years. I like her accent, well, too. Mr. Morgan? Well, I'm alive, Miss Grimshaw. These girls, Mr. Morgan, they're driving me to despair. Why? No gratitude and no manners. This younger generation, it saddens me. The world is ruined. Uh-huh. Yep, that's very nice. Listen, I'm literally just looking for the little campsite. Have you seen it? The one that I can cook my food on. What the hell do you want, Mr. Morgan? This is too much. You're gonna talk like that, potty mouth, in front of the children? You got a fever or something? I mean, it's too cold. That's the like positive that. spirit. I'm the only positive one Hello. in this whole camp. Hi, Abigail. There it is. I guess you move a little faster, but Tub Unknown, thank you so much for the follow. So, what do you think? What do you mean? About those two families. The rich ones in the big houses. I don't know. Go have a look around. See what you can find out. Calmly, I mean. Sure. Dutch and I, we both think there's money to be made. I hope so. <laughs> I'll see what I can find out. All right. Pretty sure I can't remember which one I was riding past when I was doing exploring like 20 in-game hours ago, but I'm pretty sure one of them just like destroyed me as I was running by. Good evening. You need... Oh, <laughs> shit. Arthur's just being real. I suppose, but maybe if he just had like a little more positivity. That's all I'm looking for. You need to switch to winter clothes. Okay. I need to figure out how to do that after this. All right, please. I don't have anything. Plain succulent fish. Okay. I can make that. I swear I just heard, no, I th I wasn't sure what that was either, Blob. Um, I wasn't sure if it was like a, a horse sound or... It's a bug. She's in Lemoyne, which is hot. I too get cold when I'm wearing a coat in 80 degree weather. They seem to not be able to let me know one way or another if I'm way too like hot and sweating or if I'm too cold they hate my outfit like I can do no right and we'll make this um I feel like I should go pick up a bunch of ammo maybe Okay, I know we're not supposed to be, you know, bringing out our guns and all that stuff, but when I go to poke around the gray estate, just in case. The pirate, thank you so much for the bits. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, let's cook another. We brought back a bunch of fish, so... They don't need me to donate all this right now. Okay. Good. Leave. Leave. I want a rematch with the knife, Morgan. You spoke in a Dutch since you got back? Yes, Morgan. Air is cleared. 
We're moving on. Okie dokie. When do we get another one of those like party nights? I, I don't remember what happened that constituted the last one. Um, that was fun. Drinking, singing some merry tunes. Have a seat by the fire, Arthur. Okay. How are things? Not so bad, I guess. You okay? I think so. Didn't he just tell me? He just told me to have a seat by the fire, and then they both got up and left? That's sad. I don't remember. Oh, was it getting Sean? Yeah, we need Sean to get kidnapped again, so then we can go save him, and then we can have another giant party. That is true. I guess I never noticed this as a kid, but the, um... Well, I think I'm gonna turn in. A little bit of the frosting is, like, separating. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Poor Sean. That's, like, the only way, the only path to getting another party is Sean getting kidnapped. Or, getting captured. And hopefully us getting him back. Okay. What do I want to do? Ooh. Okay, so... This is a Dutch. This is the Greys. I should probably do some of these, right? The, um... The Leopold missions. If we don't get him back, then no more party ever. Ooh, so it's an all or nothing party situation. Mm, you know what? I would risk it. I, I would risk it. Let's get a good night's sleep. And then we can talk to Strauss in the morning. Because I think we made, like, decent money doing those before. Well, I should get my beauty sleep. Pro Paganda, thank you so much for the follow. Sleep till the morning. We'll wake up well rested, ready to uh, find people to pay up on their loans. Reverend, kind of in shambles. Herr Strauss, how are you enjoying yourself here? Well enough, I guess. And you? Well, it turns out the pursuit of freedom is not a cheap business. Not for us, and not for some of the locals. Sharking already. I prefer to call it banking. You ain't the one handing out the beatings. No, but I am the one feeding the women and children in the camp. What choice should we have, okay. Mr. Morgan? Uh, okay, know. okay. Come on, then. Tell me who. Here's the list. Refinery worker turned hunter by the name of Vinton Holmes. You'll find Vinton him Holmes. up in the hills north of Strawberry. Ah, an apprentice undertaker. This one working in rows. His name was Gwen Hughes. And how many of them do you think will be able to pay? <laughs> With enough encouragement, both of them. <laughs> okay, the Rhodes one is unfortunate because... Um... We're not supposed to be making trouble there. Death Fury, thank you so much for the follow. 
Maybe this guy isn't in Rhodes per se. No, he definitely is. Shoot. So I somehow need to get this person to pay up without causing a scene and without pulling any weapons on them. Hey. Oh, what is this? Tell me, is your people uh, Jacobites or English lovers, Arthur? My people what? were peasants. We had no time for politics. My dad would say that no politics was politics. That old world bullshit, it ain't got no place here. Why? Because there ain't no judgment here. Most folks hate the Negroes, they hate the Redskins, the Jews, even us Irish. <laughs> you ain't so free of politics. I hate Jeez everyone Louise. just the same. Well, in that case, you're gonna want what I just found for us. What's that? Okay. Riding around a couple of days back, I come across this old cabin. Couple of fuckers lazing about outside, all liquored up. <laughs> I didn't think nothing of it. But then I come across this hunter down by the river. And he tells me they're a stick up crew. Says they hit a train a couple of days back near Emerald Ranch. Nice fella he was, shared a bottle we did. Then I robbed the bastard blind. <laughs> and you believed him? No reason not to. If he's right, it'll be a big haul. Oh my for gosh! Us. We saw three of them, maybe more, but I reckon you and me, we could take them real easy. All right. What the hell? Let's go check it out. <laughs> Damn sons of bitches. Think they're mean? <laughs> they're about to get a lesson in mean. I know. You just keep your cool, you hear me? This guy is like nice, tells right. you about, you know, you're clearly looking outlawish. Sean actually has a pretty cool horse, too. How far is this place? It's a bit of a ride. Not too bad. Back up north to stretch. Not far from the state line. All right. So, what were you doing riding around up there anyway? Sniffing around, looking for the take. I got a long nose for these things. Dutch has always honored us to get out there and bring in money, ain't he? And rightly so. I ain't like some of them others back there, sitting around waiting to be told I go after it. I see you sitting around plenty. I mean, I don't need no coddling <gasps> like the rest. Dutch knows okay, my Sean. The cause. As from the moment I met him. You tried to kill him, if I remember the story right. And he kept me around, didn't he? He saw something in me. He said as much. I'm sure. Dutch is good at seeing things in people. And while we're talking about money, you are clear on how this works. We split half, other half goes to the gang. Dutch keeps all our savings hidden in a safe spot outside camp. Yeah, yeah, I know. How many times do you have to tell me? Well, what's that box boy is tent for then? Camp funds, supplies and the like. <laughs> In fact, you don't know. Yeah, that. I guess I Just never really put that put together. I always pay me way. Don't you worry. You're you sure, sure you about this? this out right. Yes, see? That's why I wanted you along for this. You're still a doubter. I ain't so there's probably here. like at least a thousand dollars in whatever and this external sure fund is. External savings. Made a good show in there, didn't I? You got knocked out. Ah, that's what you choose to remember. We got paid. We got out of there. Got knocked out in Blackwater, too, didn't you? <laughs> no, that was bloody chaos. Did you get split off with Mac? Nope, didn't see him. I lost your boys at some point when he was getting out of town. They caught up with Mac a couple of days after. Davey was finished by the time we got up the mountains. Jenny didn't even make it that far. Those bounty hunters strung me up, beat me, pulled teeth, burned me fee. I didn't breathe a word about nothing, I swear. Good. And it's time folks stop giving Dutch a hard time about all that Blackwater business, if you ask me. The man's not a fortune teller. You can plan, you can use your head. 
but you never really know what you're walking into. Mm -hmm. Yep. Folks yeah, I think um, go wrong. you probably get more of the Blackwater backstory when you play through the first it. Red Dead, right? Because hey, that's one doctor. thing that. All right, that left away. We're nearly there. Hard left coming up. I kind of get like something All went right. down in Blackwater. People died that maybe weren't. Uh, like, unnecessarily died, oh, maybe? Morgan. Oh, right, right, it's after, it's after, you're right. Uh, do they mention the, the Blackwater thing at all? Let's leave the horses here and go to rest on foot. Don't want them to hear us coming. Okay. Here, I'll deal with them. Let's make sure we keep one of them alive to tell us where they stashed the money. Hope you know what you're doing. Oh, I should have grabbed my bow and arrow. Shoot. Well, too late now. There's one of them outside. This is good. It is? Leave it to me. I'll do the talking. You hang back. Hang back with, like, a gun in my hand, or...? About five seconds to get the hell off my property, boy. Uh, look, don't want no trouble. Just thought you might like to know we passed a big pot the alarm and headed this way. There were a dozen of them coming up east. What? Where? Right wow. here. It's up oh! Here the rest of them. Okay, that's not what I thought was gonna happen, but. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I should have stayed behind my tree. Ray, right, hit one shot, please. Look out on the right. On the right. My what the hell are they? Who's going to tell us where the money stashed now, huh? All right. Guess we should give the place a look. See what we can find. Uh, okay. That was definitely my bad. I didn't... Yeah, okay. That was... I, I see where I went wrong there. Where we're, we were supposed to keep one alive, and I kept none alive. So, so... That was my bad. Don't worry, I'm looting out here. Ain't much. I'm heading back to camp. Uh, Should have kept one alive. Okay, no, hold on. I I can, I can do this. I can do this. I have this thing. Okay. I found salted meat, so that's a thing. And maybe we open this. Open there. Take moonshine. Hmm. There's another fireplace. My bad. Okay, 
I will. S I'll still be able to find the stash, though. I believe in myself. Okay. Um, how about this? How about this money clip sitting out? And these. And these. Okay. Without spoilers, is there any way that I'll be able to find, unless that stash box was like the only stash that there was, do you think I'll be able to find the stash on my own? I bet it's outside. Yeah? Man. I think I found it on my own. Okay. There's some rum. I wonder if it's outside the house. Like, why would they keep it inside the house? I'm not sure if you can find it. I it seems like the go-to spots are um inside of the like chimneys or fireplaces or whatever, but this one has a fire in it. All right, let's look outside. Feeling like they would get, do the one and done type thing. Oh, I didn't loot that guy, but Maybe like around the side of the house. Excuse me, sir. What's that? What's that? Richard, thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> sticky, sticky hoppitzes. Be in one of these. Yeah, I messed up. You were right by it earlier. I don't know why there wasn't a prompt. I remember trying to... Oh... So maybe that's what it is. The game just like won't let you find it on your own. How's it going, Richard? And well, if something is hidden, you probably can't use this right to find it. Climb back up. Go back inside. All right. I will try to walk. I shall walk slower this time. Okay. Tucky bourbon.
lamp. Got in here. And over here. What about this brick? Oh no, I think it just kind of looks weird. Oh, okay. So it's just the game not letting you like find it on its own. Okay, now that we know that it won't even prompt me, where is it or what is it? Yeah, I feel like I can see something. I can, like, see something behind here. Dang it. Ugh, those beds. Sleep on the ground would be less comfortable. But definitely less. You know, who even knows what sort of bugs and, like, rodents and bleh. Okay, where are we even? Oh, we got... He's British, of course. There's someone here you can meet. Okay. Oh, didn't hold. Okay. You guys want to go meet a stranger? Like the house on fire. Those beds. Oh, yeah, yeah. Go meet a, make a new friend. Is it this? Oh, what did that say? Pick and examine. Sage. danger ray but who knows it looks like this is some sort of uh i don't know whenever i see red cards like that i always think of a circus so oh, this is a pretty pickle What the devil are you looking at? I'm sorry? No, I'm sorry. I'm ruined. Why ruined. ruined? How so? It's a disaster. Who wants to see a woman wrangle wild animals who doesn't have any bloody wild animals? Come to America, they said. Come to the land of opportunity, they said. Sod you, Daddy, I said. I'm going to America to make it on the stage. I don't want to be in the army. Oh, now look at me. The old git will have a field day. I didn't really understand any of that. I had an act. The <gasps> bravest like... woman in the world. The animal wrangler. Watch her tame wild beasts. And you were the woman. Of course I was the bloody woman. Look at me. It's the stage. Grease paint. Tears. No one wants to see a man wrangling wild animals. And no one wants to see a woman wrangling nothing. <laughs> Can I borrow your gun? I want to shoot myself. You see, I'm buggered. Why? My Why? Animals, they escaped, and now I'm, I'm buggered. What, what escaped? A priceless Ranjaniki tiger from the slopes of the Hindu heights. A fantastic, elusive zebra from the plains of Ongo Bongo by the shores of the Limpopo. And a magnificent lion from the grasslands of Tanganyika. Yeah, I see your problem. They're pretty hard to come by around here. Listen, friend. Help a fellow out, would you? I'm beyond desperate. If you see any okay. of them, will you bring them back here? If I see a tiger or a lion or a 
zebra just roaming around. Exactly. If, well, I believe the zebra's up near Lonard Sod. Distinctive creature that he is. I'll make it worth your while. All right, madam. It's bloody Margaret, not madam. Okay. Margaret. Finally. Mistress of fucking danger. Okay. Um. This is. Okay, the zebra. I think I can still call for a hot tomato. And the sooner the better, please. Shut the front door. It is a circus. It's that very distinctive red color. Yes, yes. A, a woman wearing a mustache. To add a little more drama to the circus. All right, hot tomato. Got something brand new for us to do. We are going to wrangle a zebra. Cheerio. Yeah. Oh, geez, Louise. Okay, zebra, zebra, zebra. I think I have like three different missions started right now. Oh no, I guess I I don't feel like I completed the uh that last one though, because I didn't get the big prize because I got a little I accidentally headshot that guy and left nobody alive, so Yes, sirs. Go in, go in. Oop. So up now. Okay, so just somewhere in this area, there's a lot of accidents. They can pile up sometimes, which is good, because then it's like. Then you have options for what you want to do. Like, do you want to go rob a house or do you want to go investigate the graves or like help Dutch with something? I accidentally drank six beers and got to go to work in the morning. Honestly, happens to the best of us. Accidentally drinking six beers. Yep. Okay. I feel like I should get high ground. Better chance of... Colors just didn't come in. No. Right? No. No. That's the zebra? Yep. Lucky. Hey. What they done to you? Hey, hey. Sheep. 
painted a donkey. What? What? Why? Okay, Margaret. So, got your donkey. I can't even imagine what the lion and the tiger... Or did you actually get a lion and a tiger, huh? <laughs> the music suits the mood, it really does. Bernhardt Games, thank you so much for the follow. The mission should have been named nothing as it seems. That true, true though. Uh how much does the zebra skin go for? No RPG. Since this, this is your first playthrough, what do you think so far? Um Mara, at first, I was, like, I felt pretty overwhelmed by just all the different, like, aspects of the game, you know? The cores. The cores still get me, to be just totally honest. Um, and then the different weapons and trying to, like figure out how to not advance too quickly in game so you can do enough of the like side quests overall though i think the game looks amazing all of the side quests have been really good um i've been kind of slow i guess at advancing the main quest uh i literally just got to chapter three and i'm like over 30 in game hours already but I feel like um, I hope they do more like character development or I, I want to get to know the people in my camp a lot better than just like the two little greetings you can do with them. I'm afraid to run any faster, but maybe I can. Oh, okay. I know, donkey. What's going on? Come this way. Sounds so sad. Looks like my homeland. Hey, how's Red Dead? It's really good, Bernhardt. Actually, that was perfect timing because you probably heard my, like, likes and it's not even dislikes, but, um, uh, I guess I assumed that Red Dead 1 was, like, close enough in time to Red Dead 2 that they, I'm sure they probably introduced everybody in the first one, but maybe it's, like, a totally different cast of people, um, yeah. Let that donkey be free. Does that make you Shrek? My coat is kind of green though. Have you played Last of Us? No, I haven't played Last of Us and I feel like that is a, that's a must play game. Just, in, you just, you have to play. Um, oh, wait, is the issue that Last of Us the first Last of Us is not on PC. No! No, shoot! How did this, how did this happen? Come on. Come on. This is very tough. Stonky was doing all right for a bit, but now we are at a, we are at a standstill. I feel like I can see the red in the distance. We're so close. 
Reddit one is set in 1911 and 1914. Oh, okay. So a little, little bit of a difference for sure. Based on what I've seen, it's definitely a bucket. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a for sure play, and I thought it was try to sprint. Go a teensy bit faster. Good grief! You found him! Our zebra! <laughs> well, you can't call him that. <laughs> well, he's as right, much there's a like, zebra mm -hmm. as you are a lady animal wrangler. Oh, you yeah. may be heavy the point, for the poor. You? I know, I feel too bad. Of the eye to bamboozle the senses. Confound yeah, you're, you're scamming Hoodwink people. your audience. Hoodwink. Exactly. Our audiences. <laughs> Dear boy, don't be so dreadfully literal. No one will pay for the truth. They only pay for deception. The allure of the stage. Dreams and reality. Ah. What is the greater conjuring trick? Lassoing some poor beast on the plains of Mumbo Jumbo Land and shipping it here so it can dance the polka or turning. There, in the glare of those arc lamps, something mundane into something extraordinary. It's the difference between prose and poetry. It's alchemy. We're selling dreams, dear boy. Well, yeah, okay. As long as you don't pay me with tickets to your show. Ah, uh, yes. Well, it's not everyone's cup of tea. And speaking of my payment... Of course, of course. I shall make it worth your while. But, um, first, we shall need the whole menagerie back before we can think about that. Yeah, this My guy's not gonna gone pay us. Tiger? tiger? Yes, yes. And taken our remaining lion in case it could lend a paw. They're down there on Caliga Way. Please, I hate to ask. All right, I'll see what I can do. All right. Just because I am so curious as to what these actually are, we'll finish helping. Okay, fella. Get out of these woods, and you'll find the road. It should lead you right to them. Okay. Beautiful. Hate that does that. Last sin, Last of Us one and two. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Mara. Um, which I have a, I have a PlayStation Four, so I think all I would need is a capture card to be able to play. But still, in Red Dead multiplayer back in the day, you had a zebra donkey as your mount. It's the fastest mount in the game, multiplayer exclusive. Wait, so if you it you once you got to like a certain level or something in multiplayer, like a zebra donkey just shows up. Do you have a switch? Yes, I do have a switch. The assistant was a tiger. I'm like I'm mentally preparing myself for the assistant to be like a monkey or something just really ridiculous. Although if he painted a um if he painted a donkey, he probably isn't just like hanging out with a monkey and got it fully trained, you know? You little, thank you so much for the follow. Ooh, ooh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yep, my bad. First Red Dead had some good DLC. That was the Four Horses of the Apocalypse. Last of Us is also on PS now. Wait, what? What's BOTW? Breath of the Wild? No. But another game that has had. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, oh! You always rely on you, boy. I think I like sometimes freak him out. You all set? 
Everything hey, good? Hi there. How's, How's it going? going? I've seen better days, tell you. What's All going on? Right, well, good luck. Bye now. Okay. Guess we don't ask him what's wrong. You can choose them out when you hit level four. Uh, what do you play on your Switch if it's not Breath of the Wilds? Literally. Um, Animal Crossing and Tetris and I guess that's it so far. I literally bought it for, uh, oh, is this the assistant? Hello. Hey, mister. Oh. Miss. Howdy, mister. Hi. Did, um, did you lose a tiger? Yeah, you found one? Nah, I found your caravan down the way. Uh, Margaret said that you might need a hand. Oh, he weren't wrong. That tiger's missing. I sent our best lion out to find him, and uh, now he's missing too. It is a right old predicament. Your lion I would from say. Timbuktu, weren't he? From Valentine, I think. He might be more of a kind of dog than a lion, but in a certain light, a feller could never tell. It's gonna of be like course. a golden retriever go. or something and right now. Over there. Okay. Why don't you hop up on the wagon and I'll see if I can find his track. Okay. That first set of shrubs, that's where I lost sight of him. I got it. Okay. So once I get down here. Mandos Mandos cosplay? Thank you so much for the follow. Okay, so now we do this little thing, right? Aha. Got the trail. These are paw prints. I'm gonna move this back up. Looks like like blood to me. Well, what's this? Keep hitting the wrong button. Found your dog. Ex dog, ex lion. Hey, boy. Oh, where's the rest of them? I think a cougar took him. Oh, that'd be stripey. And I always thought they got along. But your tiger is a wild cat? Uh huh. What else? You still need it back? Oh, yes, sir. She's our star attraction. <sighs> well, let's hope it wants the other half of its dinner. <clears throat> The other half? Really? I'm gonna put them in your wagon. You find somewhere to hide. Oh. Well, uh, behind that log then. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Up. We have to chuck it like that? Stay down. She won't be too far away. I went out to find a tiger. Cougar, you mean? And I end up losing a lion. Yeah, a dog. Ain't having any luck. Well, if that's what you're dealing with, you didn't have any luck to begin with. <laughs> Cougars and dogs. Hey, it ain't what you got in this life. It's what you make of it. Well, that's very wise of you. That's some real. Especially yeah, when rip doggo. Zebras and tigers. Well, we met dog me. No, bro. It's coming. Look, Where? I really don't think she'll eat the dog. Like I said, they was friends. She shut it. Oh, well, I guess she's real hungry. She's feral. I'm locking her in.
right. Let's go. We got her! Okay. Drive, will you? And I'll keep an eye on her. Sure thing. <laughs> let's get it's her a really back awful her. mission. She's still eating. Yes, the sides oh are God. distant and unreachable. Close and, you know, a, uh, a wild, a wild animal with a pretty good sense of smell go won't be able to see you or smell you. We might not have lost those animals to begin with. Seeming friendly one minute, dinner the next. This is this comes easy. I mean, I should know. I've run with a few of them myself. Is that right? No, not really. Hey, uh, I realize I ain't properly introduced myself. Sally Nash. Arthur Morgan. Nice to meet you, sir. Nice Tell to meet me, you, Miss Sally. Nash, how do you end up in this wreck? Guess it's always been my inclination, you know? Wild beasts and the like. I met Mr. Margaret, we got to talking, and you can probably tell in this field he's the ace of spades. He's a card, all right. It's my modest hope one day to be the world's second bravest woman animal wrangler. I'd say all right. You, got that sewn up and then some. you think? I hope so. Top five, at least. It depends on how many more fellers throw their hat in the ring. Maybe one of these days, the best female for the job will actually be a female. Oh, I don't know if that'll ever happen. We lost the main road around here when the dust was up. Be careful, you might get wrecked too. All right. right. You know, the only thing to do in a dust storm is wait it out. Mr. Margaret's a lot of things, but oh god, oh god, oh god. One of them. Uh, imagine you're right about that. I overcorrected. Here, looking for any kind of landmark when over we go. Whole caravan toppled. Found each other and some shelter, but when the wind died down, the animals was gone. But uh, now they're back. Some of them, at least. Thanks to you. Oh, uh, you would have managed it yourself. Oh, I bet this guy isn't going to pay us because... Well, no. Technically, we're bringing the body of the lion back, so... I'll leave the professional theatrics to better women than me. There it is. The caravan. Good. Aha! I see you found each other. Sure did, Mr. Margaret. Jolly good. Jolly good. You know, tarn and feathering a donkey is one thing. I beg your pardon? It's grease paint. Makeup. But playing dolls dressed up with a wild animal, you're gonna want to be a lot more careful. Strappy eight king, Mr. Margaret. I saw her do it. I always thought they got along. Oh, she liked him just fine. She licked her chops and asked for seconds. Hey, speaking of which, you got okay. any more work on that uh, let's runaway just, line? Let's just you not. pay me for these misfits? Look, I'm well aware that we're not Royal Command performance material. Daddy, you were right, goddamn you! But a cow barn in Rhodes is hardly Drury Bloody Lane. You got any word on the lion? Yes, yes, I've got word on the lion. Shit is the word. Someone saw him near Emerald Ranch. As you know, we're lately very short on lions. So, I'd be very grateful. All kinds of grateful. Oh, here There's we go. There's one kind of grateful I care about. So long, mister. Be a dear and fix me a gin. Oh, we're going to steal a dog, aren't we? Well, at least we're going to be near Emerald Ranch. I think I have some things to sell, so... He's the ace of spades when aces are low. Maybe the key is to not wash when Arthur smells like a heap of... <laughs> exactly. We, we just blend into our surroundings. If the tiger ate the lion, does it make it a liger? Stomach is a liger, I guess. Hannah Derrick, thank you so much for the follow and thank you so much for the bits. Do you play Red Dead Online? I'm going to wait to play online until I make it through the story mode first, but I definitely, I've heard really good things about it, so I definitely want to check it out. Don't steal me. You're coming with me, Juan. 
Yeah, but I don't know if there's anything like spoilery or not spoilery or any of that jazz, but. Well, at least we're gonna get there at nighttime, so easier to, you know, yeah. steal somebody's family pet. Came out of nowhere. They just come out of nowhere. Just like, I don't even know. One, it just, they look like little logs on the ground. Red Dead Online takes place before Red Dead, so no no spoilers. Okay, that that's all right. <laughs> it's it's fine. We're just gonna hydrate, and then we're gonna keep on moving. Why is this so adamant about me going? Like, why not just cut across? Yeah. Running. Excuse me, everybody. Mm -hmm. Almost there. Real good boy. Okay, search for the lion. The ruckus, boys. Get back! We got a cursed creature in here. Oh yeah? It's as big as a mule and as mean as a hellcat. <laughs> it looked like a lion to me. That's a dog in there. A dog? Now, you excuse me. Step aside. What? I said, step aside. No dog. Come here, boy. Let's go. Okay. I will admit, I have not heard what every dog on Earth has sounded like you know, to confirm nor deny, but that kind of sounds like a lion to me. <laughs> Diesel Kid, thank you so much for the follow. Um, yeah, so. I see. Okay, I think this is gonna be 
a uh this is your headphone warning everybody look what you've done look what you've done son of a bitch oh i'll take care of this Oh, why not use this? Back there? It's so hard to tell. Lion? I mean, I probably shouldn't kill it either. What should I be aiming for? Its legs? Maybe I'll try to aim for its legs. Answering to do. I never seen one of those before, and I hope I don't again. Amen to that. Do you mean the uh, the lion or the floating gun? Because really could go either way here. Oh, jeez Louise. Oh, that's the invisible man? All right, good call. Good call, man. I don't know what's going on, but. You've gathered the ingredient required to make the lion's paw trinket. Take this ingredient to the fence to craft this trinket. Why would you take it to the fence? Well, if I can just grab my gun, I'll just be on my way. Yep. At the fence, unfortunately. I mean... Why did Margaret have an actual lion? Right? Didn't even like, oh, it is an actual lion, just makes you think. Yep, checked his pulse, confirmed dead, you guys. Uh, I tried everything I could. I didn't realize it was an actual. Oh God, why does it make that noise? Wait, the cow's still alive. Hold on.
Right? You can hear it? Walked. No, I didn't walk on the cow, you guys. I was performing CPR. How else do you think you would perform CPR on a cow? You know? Winning loser, thank you so much for the follow. Like... You need to pulse. 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 Oh god! Oh! Okay, my foot- my foot got a little caught. Let's just... Let's just... Um... I'm not sure what happened there. Well, we'll just wait here till the morning. Wait, I can't wait here till the morning. Uh, okay. What's my option? <laughs> CPR gone wrong. Okay, this is what happens when you try to perform CPR and you are not CPR certified. Was that the proper way to do CPR? Probably not. Should have taken a certification course. I don't like horror and I think it'd be hilarious to watch you play a horror game. I think you would all sue me for various um, uh, medical bills from your eardrums rupturing, bleeding, like... Time to go, I, don't, boy. I don't know why... Uh, the fence guy. Yeah. Is there a place that I can like sleep Whoa, in town? Geez. What is that? <laughs> chest compressions, chest compressions. You know what? With a larger animal, it kind of made sense to me to, uh, you know, use your feet for chest compressions, but anywho. All right, I guess I'll run here and then maybe I can go back to the fence after. <laughs> yeah, there'd be no way that you play it or watch me play it. I have to go to my CPR course next week. Good, Smokey. I'm glad this this reminded you of your... I'm hearing a sound that's like... I don't know what it is. Yeah. Oh, that's true, that's true. I forget about the little campsite thing. I guess it's gonna be morning soon, so I'll just hit here, go back, and then back. <laughs> yeah, quick question. Um, somebody told me that the proper way to perform CPR on a cow is uh, chest compressions with your feet, full body weight on top. Uh, correct or not? <laughs> Dude, yeah, yeah. I, I do know you probably should not put your full body weight slash feet on a human person to perform CPR. Odysseus returns! Sally, get the cages ready! Yes, sir, Mr. Market, right away! Man eaten lion. You didn't think that it might be useful for me to know that this time the animal was actually real, you moron? Steady on. I clearly stated that we were looking you for You haven't clearly stated anything in all the time I've known you. That could have been a goose for all I a knew. A goose? We'll hardly get them to their feet for the curtain call. Bring on the king of the beasts, on the other hand, and they feel the roar. And they, well, look about as surprised as you do. What have you done with him, if you don't mind me asking? I killed him. He's dead. Bloody hell! This is Rambo, boy. We're probably not gonna get paid me. anymore. Now, pay me. <laughs> yes, of course, of course. Sir or I ma'am, I learned this thing. technique and from watching a very reputable streamer. <laughs> Trust me. You're a lucky man, sir. Very lucky man. Why? 
from the mines of El Dorado, as green as the rainforest, as clear as the Amazon, and as dear as all the gold in the Andes. One man's labor is but a trifle compared to this jewel's true value. Wait! I shouldn't. What would Daddy say? Your Daddy ain't here, and we had a deal. Yes, of course. A promise is a promise. Sally, get the wagons moving. Ain't we waiting for the line? He's in the great hunting ground in the sky. Good day, sir, and thank you. But we really must be getting along. Yeah, I won't keep yep. you. So long. So long, Mr. Morgan. Next time you see me, I'll be topping the bill, I promise. All right, bye-bye well, now. Got an emerald, though. It's pretty good. Does it, I know, yeah. There's. I'm going to go try to sell this at the fence right now, and he's going to be like, Sir, this is a ring pop. You've been bamboozled, you know? I don't know if the person that gave this to you thought you were a moron, but... Sir, sir, this is a Wendy's? That's like one of my favorite memes at the moment. Oh my gosh, who else is loving the Bernie Sanders? Oh. Okay, everybody, let's just chill out. The Bernie Sanders meme. Ray, I told you not to take candy from strangers, but he told me it was a priceless family heirloom. And that guy lied to me about everything else, so... Oh! Um, <laughs> hey, when you got yourself a good pair of mittens, like, they become your everyday mittens, they become, you know, fancy event. I, I want those mittens too, honestly. That is the second animal I've run over in 10 minutes. Oh, and it's a poor pelt, too. Dang it. Probably not worth anything. And yep. off we go. Look at that. Here, bright and early. Remember you. Passed through here some time ago, huh? Yep. And I'm here to sell stuff. $50? Okay. <laughs> They're all bad if you run them over, aren't they? What if Hot Tomato hit a headshot? Like, hoof to head. I don't know. Joe, how's it going? <laughs> so prints all over it. Some people think it would, it's art. I emailed the mail. Oh, thank you, Pachu. Is there Gwent in this game? There's no Gwent, but there's dominoes and poker, so. Uh, I've, I've given them both a little, what, well, we've spent some time. Ooh. Okay, so these, platinum, gold buckles. Oh, okay.
Okay. Now, the $350 question. Should I keep the gold ingot and the emerald? Then <laughs> why are you playing it? I know. I know. I, I just got to give back to the Witcher. A little tip. Only sell pocket watches, buckles, gold, jewelry bags, and keep all the rare stuff. Okay, so hypothetically speaking, if I just sold a pearl necklace, um, not good. That was not the play. Does it have horseshoes in the knife game? I've not seen horseshoes, but if by knife game you mean five finger fillet, then yes. Dying costs money, not gold. Keep the gold. All right, we'll keep them as is. They're they're both pretty valuable. Now I kind of wish I didn't sell the large jewelry bag, but. Hmm. Been a while since you were through here. Okay, on, let's have see. A quick nosy. Apparently, a you mine, can huh? craft me something, and I just bought it. That's okay. I just wanted to take a look, but um, okay. And now it's gone. Ram horn trinket. Oh, they're all legendaries. Permanently increases the player's stamina experience bonus by 10%. Okay. You want to know how to turn shit and stones to bread? Ask a country boy. Okay. B Scoot, thank you so much for the follow. Sell them? What? I I have I actually have a decent amount of money. If this was back when I had like a hundred dollars to my name, like everything easily would have been gone. But. I do keep some items that have sentimental Pretty value here, to me, you know? you're thinking. Well, close your eyes and smell the cow shit. Oh. Okay. I didn't... I did not realize, so... Vintage Civil War handcuffs. Okay. I need a quartz chunk and a silver chain bracelet in order to make the bear claw talisman. So everybody to keep that here. In this world. I'm not one to judge. Trinkets are awesome. I love trinkets. Yeah, you guys are here, you know. I just hope nobody's missing this too much. Okay, and what does he normally, what can you buy from him? Dynamite. Lock breaker. Used to silently break locks. Hmm. I sell cheap, huh? Is the lock breaker a one and done type thing? Or is it once you buy it, you have it through the rest of the game? Heck hammer, thank you so much for the follow. You never know when you're gonna need dentures or a lock breaker. Sell your gold if you want, there's plenty to be found. Uh, I'm okay without it. If I get to a point in the game where they're like, oh my gosh, you cannot continue the game unless meet. you have $1,000, then, you know. In Witcher 3, we were keeping random dentures and stuff. We were keeping broken rakes. You never know if somebody would need them. It's one at a time. Okay, so does the place behind the... Um, behind the doctor's office? There's no lock on the outside, on so... Give me a try. Hey, Ominous, how's it going? Lockbreaker is buy one and you have it forever. Really? I mean, it's $22. $22 would be worth it if it's like you, you have it forever type deal. 
Maybe it breaks at some point, just about but the most profitable thing on this here range. Nick from Mars, thank you so much for the follow. All right, I'm gonna buy nice. it. Thank you. Fully restores dead eye, fortifies moderately. I haven't been buying the snake oil, but maybe I should be now that I have a little money. Campus sack, hood, metal skull mask, psycho mask, poison arrow, homing tomahawk, special bitters, horse meal. I never my. asked a question about an acquisition in my life. Okay, sorry, sir. I just needed to reacquaint myself with everything you had. You keep. Oh, good. I'm loving this game too, Nick. It's really good. I always blow up anything that needs breaking. The, so that's what I was gonna try to do with the the thing on the back of the doctor's office, and then I realized that I didn't have any you've dynamite. you've been struggling to sell a little something, give me a try. I wonder if it would break though. Masks are good for robberies. If you're wondering what? if I don't get do the job those, done, so it will. All good things, press seed this late. <laughs> I know. Well, I had a meeting until nine, and then I was like, okay, I'm still like, I'm getting my Red Dead time in, so. Do I buy dynamite just to have it? Like, you never know when you're gonna need Careful with those. dynamite. I'm good. Yeah, I think I missed a uh, Viking earlier saying that he was going to bed. <laughs> Meeting at late hours. It really was. I, I would not, please. If I didn't have to be somewhere and start streaming an hour later, like. Oh my gosh. Have a good night, psych. Okay, let's just have. Do not leave it near the campfire. Let's just have two dynamite for, you know, just in case purposes, right? I think that makes sense. Thanks. Hey! It's hey, you! Boy. How's it going? How's it going, good boy? Yeah? Oh my gosh. All right. <laughs> I gotta tell you this thing that ha it actually happened right here last night. It was crazy. I met this guy, crazy as can be, has his own little circus thing, whatever. Tells me that he's lost his zebra, his tiger, and his lion. First thing I go find is his zebra. Yeah, zebra here, that's what I said. Turns out it's a donkey with painted on stripes. Okay. Next, I gotta go help find the lion. Lion ends up, same sort of deal, ends up being this cougar. To, it ate one of the other lions. Yeah, I, I won't tell you what that, that fake lion was. But anyways, um, right, so then he has a second lion. I come here, I'm thinking that lion is what the first lion was so i just go bust into the barn turns out it was an actual freaking lion jumps down kills some people takes out like a cow a horse on the way out and uh yeah i did end up having to kill it it was it was kind of sad but yep <sighs> safar supari thank you so much for the follow Oh, what did the fake lion end up being? Um, it's probably for the best, I don't tell you. No, no, I can tell you. I just... I just don't have the heart. Don't make me say it, man. It was a dog. Oh god. I was so sorry. I know I got there too late. Anyway, 
guys. It was good catching up with you. Uh, I'll see you next time I'm in, t I'm in town. Toodles. Yeah, I feel awful. I definitely should have told him that. <laughs> what the heck? I... He... He asked! Got to know dogs can still be dogs. <laughs> anyway, we used the rest of him as bait to catch a mountain lion. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm glad we left that part out. That would have just absolutely destroyed him. Oh, don't worry about donating so far. I I'm just playing games and having fun. You hanging out in chat is good. <laughs> it's probably would have ruined his whole week, honestly. Do, do, do. <laughs> it's good stuff. That was good RP with the dog. Thank you. I'm trying to build a uh, an audition tape for. I don't. I don't know if there's any like. I'm sure there are, like, Red Dead RP servers, but, um... Help me. Help me. What's going on? Help. Help. You okay, mister? Please. I've been bitten by a snake. <gasps> <gasps> I need medicine. You need to drink this. Is that medicine? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, oh. I owe you one, mister. There, right. Hopefully, I could repay you someday. Uh, ah. oh, I gotta get out of here. I'm sorry, I don't know why I randomly just whipped out my gun like that, but... Out here! No more! Do you need a ride somewhere, or...? Just stay the hell away from snakes, all right? You'll be fine. Okay, well, that is that. <laughs> it's... Gonna slay. See you later. You stream this weekend? Yes, I will be back on Saturday. I may start Saturday a teensy bit early. Um, I I'm not sure if I'm gonna have something for work or not. So, I if I do start early, it's gonna be like 1 p.m. instead of 2 p.m. But uh, yeah, I will see you there. I know. I'm just headed back to camp and then. Probably gonna stop there anyways. Ooh, I forgot. Oh goodness, I need to eat food. Peaches? Where am I going? I'm like trying to take a shortcut, kind of, but... Don't traumatize him, too. Honestly, he would have been traumatized if I did end up, like, trying to suck the venom out. It's honestly just better if you give them medicine, I think. Just a bit easier, you know? You really get busy on the weekends, um, yeah. like, work-wise. There's just a lot of projects that didn't get finished last year that we're now in like a, a mad dash to finish up now. Um, which is why like I'm having these daily meetings and stuff at night and then in the morning. Um, so it's not gonna be like a forever thing, I know, but in the time being, you're just like, 
I just want to play yeah. Red Dead, man. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> to quote impossibly misquote Shrek. I will repay you unless I can't find you or forget. Vax. I know. Who does he shout that at? I will repay you. Don't forget. Right? Uh, I picture that quote in Shrek's voice, but um, I suppose that's kind of more of like a donkey thing to say. Yeah. Attending meetings. <laughs> Mine is finding the way. Wait, what is happening? Sorry, sir. Got got a little lost uh, on the way to my camp. I think I overshot it a little bit. You're a good boy. Oh, is there like a fish mission? That's cool. I do often ponder in these meetings though, um, ab about Red Dead. In Shark 2 when he and Donkey rob. Oh, the nobles for clothes. Yeah, but is it him that says it or Donkey? Cause in my mind, I, I feel like it's him saying it, but. Safu, thank you so much for the follow. And Ikaro910, thank you so much for the, f the follow. Nine ten. Nine ten. Yeah, that makes sense. And Prancing Pony, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, that's what I thought too. Life of the Scientist is one busy hard experience, right? Well, to wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? Sup. Um Yeah, well it's a lot of like I get mentally exhausted a lot Put at work. On, would you? Cause it's uh like specifically for you guys that are like new here or whatever. So I'm a data scientist. So I'm looking at numbers and just sort of like my mind thinks of like ways to like transform the numbers in a way that people can use them. So it's just the long days feel longer to me because you're mentally just sort of like doing this in your brain all day. Um, and it, it adds up. And then you just want to relax and play some Red Dead at night. And then they put meetings on at night. And you're just like, why? Ah. Do you have to take care of your horse much? Um, I probably should be doing it more. Um, I, I'm really bad with keeping up on the cores, my own and my horses, but I don't know if there's things that you should be doing continuously for your horse. So they like continue to like you or not red. Yes. Yeah. That's to That's exactly what I think too, Mando. Like it's just this escape, like. You just forget technology and looking at a computer screen. And even though I'm technically looking at a computer screen, I feel like I'm in the game. And it's just, it's it's different. And I, I enjoy streams so much because I can just get lost in the game. We have a bunch of laughs and you guys are here and you come up with funnies and it's just a good time.